Hello everybody, this is Tim Stewart. I want to share something with you from Zechariah. It's chapter 8, verse 23. It says, Thus said Hashem, Master of Legions, In those days it will happen that ten men of all different languages and nations will take hold. They will take hold of the corner of the garment of a Jewish man, saying, Let us go with you, for we have heard that God is with you. It is very important that our Christian brothers and sisters understand that the grafting in that Paul talks about in the book of Romans is making it very clear. And this was also said, this was also said to Abraham in the book of Genesis. When you are grafted in, you become a part of. And if the olive tree of Israel is bearing fruit and you're grafted in, you should be bearing the same fruit. And I want you to please listen and understand. If Israel is under attack, it means that, yes, you're under attack also. It doesn't mean just because it hasn't happened to you yet that it doesn't concern you. It does. Rabbi Shapira, my rabbi, has written a book called The New Hamas. and Everybody's heard all the news and everybody's been talking about it and how horrible people have been saying, well, you know, Israel has a right to defend itself. And, you know, quite frankly, I'm tired of hearing people say that. What other nation in the world is that said about? Of course, any nation has a right to defend itself. That, that shouldn't even be brought up. But <clears throat> my rabbi, Rabbi Shapira, has written a book called The New Hamas. And people are talking about oh, the prophecy of this and the prophecy of that and what does this mean for the end times. And, you know, right now, I really don't even care about that. I don't care about discussing those things. What I do care about is the prophecy about the church being grafted into Israel and about the responsibility that Israel and the church have together of working together about bringing the kingdom of God. When God destroyed the earth in a flood, it was because of Hamas. It was because of extreme violence in the earth. And we're there again. The earth has become very violent. All you have to do is look at the news. Wars and rumors of wars. So I'm not going to try to discuss all of it. I Quite frankly, I don't even want to think about it at times. But Rabbi Shapira has written a book called The New Hamas. God gives people abilities. Some people he gives greater abilities. Rabbi Shapira has looked at all of this in the Hebrew, which unlocks a lot of things. And he explains it in his book very, very clearly about what's going on. So my brothers and sisters in the church, please understand this directly involves you also. So I'm going to ask you, please click on the link. Rabbi Shapiro's book will blow you away. And I don't mean that as something exciting. I mean, it will be a real eye-opener. And if you really want to know where the world stands, if you really want to know what's going on, read this book. Now, I'm going to say something. I know that some people are going to have a knee-jerk reaction against it, and that's fine. I can tell you when the Messiah is coming back. He says it very clearly. Jerusalem, you will not see me again until you say, Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord. And my point in, in saying that is this. It's Israel who will call him back. If you're waiting on some spectacular rapture to take place to get you out of here, you're looking for the wrong thing. It's not going to happen. And if you want to discuss it with me, fine. I will be more than happy to discuss it with you based upon what Scripture says. But please understand, you need to know what's going on. This directly involves you. Again, I'm going to put the link directly below this where you can go and you can buy the book. Or you can go and you can buy the book and the DVD together. It's eye-opening, and you really should get it to 
understand the times that we live in. So God bless you. Shalom. And may we see the return of Messiah come soon and bring peace to the earth.